Bitcoin futures. Bitcoin futures have made a fairly hard work of it at this level. You can see there was a pullback just over a month ago. The market recovered to close. This is the highs of the range. Last week saw a pretty deep shakeout and volume was increased on that and well above the average. So there was a lot of supply on that bar. But this week in response, you've had a serious test for supply for the whole week. Spread narrowed considerably. Volume was low, below average, and certainly reduced over the previous bar. This is showing that selling pressure in the market was low last week and is likely low overall. This leaves the market well-placed to push higher in response, and it really should do so. You've had a shakeout and a test, and that often means a breakout in response, or at least an attempt to break out. This market should really push higher in response, and if it doesn't, you have to really question what's going on right now, because it's taken a long time for this to take place, much longer than normal. So there's been some difficulties around this level, and it really needs to get moving now. It's had the pullback to test for supply and remove any supply from the market, and it really should make a serious attempt to push higher in response.